I find it interesting the whole um, how galleries work and how people interact with artworks. Some paintings, they have that hold on you where they've got so much more power than just that tiny little reproduction. You have to be in front of the actual image, which is what I like about art. You have to experience it. You can't just go, well, I've looked at this book, therefore I know enough and move on. Maison Bateau is a traditional patisserie in Soho, which has also gained a reputation as a gallery, which is a difficult thing to do nowadays. It's a different world now because you have your factories where you get the works made and you have all your assistants and art doesn't seem to be this personal thing. It's more it's got more of a business side to it. It's, it's about the collector and it's about the whole concept of the fame of the artist and like then they've been interviewed in the observer, blah 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 and it's, it's more about being known as an artist than in terms of what you do as an artist. I find that I prefer the um, concept of like artists like Auerbach, who like sit in their studio every single day of the year, busily painting, and they have this lifestyle that is about making the art. My flat is becoming my studio. So I find I produce many more works than I can actually find spaces for, to be honest. I've got artworks stored in the corridors, in the studio, and then more of them in the living room. So it's gradually encroaching and taking over. I think I've done the white enough, I don't know. That should be enough for the painting. I don't need much more than that. So I'm starting a new um, oil painting and I've got the base down, but it's just a case of actually trying to get the image down as simply and effectively as possible. When you're actually applying the paint, you're applying just enough so it looks quite uh, instantaneous and not overworked.
initially I was um, working with um, images of known artists like Francis Bacon, Damien Hirst, people of celebrity within the art world. And then once I'd done a certain number of those pieces, it was more moving on to um, actual artists in their studios. In terms of the type of things I work from, you, I've been doing images of the observers, performance artists, and um, auctions, and hanging works, and various other different processes related to the art world, whether they're the more visible images which the public would see, or the what happens prior to them even going out to the actual galleries. I think it's nice to actually have them side by side as they follow some of the same themes. Subject matter of both my paintings is Franco B, who's a performance artist who's more well known for doing performances involving bleeding and physicality. And with, um, with uh, Damien Hurst, with this work, it's actually got um, blood and evocations of death on it, so they follow the same type of themes but in different ways. In a way, it's like as if like time has like slowed down, and they're just it's just that int that intimate experience between the figure and the actual object. It's a much quicker world, and everything's much faster, and doesn't have that longevity. Many experiences nowadays. So I think it's a comment on that as well. It's like, you know, that people still are actually appreciating work. 